हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल सृष्टि संवर्धन द रेनी सीजन इज हियर एंड वी आर प्लांटिंग सम मोरिंगा ब्रांचेस इन आर गार्डन फॉर द फॉर्मेशन ऑफ गुड ह्यूमर्स यू रिक्वायर सम ऑर्गेनिक नाइट्रोजन कंटेंट इन द मार्चिंग अलोंग विद द ऑर्गेनिक कार्बन कंटेंट द रेशियो ऑफ ऑर्गेनिक कार्बन टू ऑर्गेनिक नाइट्रोजन इज सिक्सटीज टू सिक्स so along with the other crops you should have some leguminous crops such as dals or the moringa plant so that uh, the ratio is maintained and we can prevent the organic carbon from escape in the atmosphere so we already have a big tree which gives us fruits last year also we had planted some sap seedlings of which two have survived and this year also we are planting some branches what we do is add some dried leaves in a pit add ghana jivamrut jivamrut dip the branch of the moringa tree in the jivamrut and plant it hope that some of these will survive for the next season as you know moringa plant is a high rich source of nutrition its leaves contain lot of minerals vitamins such as calcium etc even the drumsticks are highly nutritious the leaves can be used for making various vegetables the drumstick also can be used in making for making curries and vegetables even the flowers of the drumstick can be used for making vegetables soups etc so this can be form a very good source of nutrition and is very available almost for free so it can be used to prevent malnutrition in the uh, children as well as in the pregnant ladies so if everyone of us should try to plant maximum moringa trees so that cheap source of nutrition is available for the children and pregnant ladies So once the plant grows big, you can trim the branches of it and use it for mulching, so that the soil content of the organic nitrogen increases, and there is no need of giving fertilizers such as urea. So hoping that some of these branches will survive. Thank you for watching.